All right, let's visualize our zygomycete, our moldy bread. All right, we got our moldy bread there. It's been going about a week. Real simple, take that out. Take your magical fancy science tweezers and a little bit of turmeric and some hot water. It's gonna take some turmeric Throw it into the hot water. All right, we got ourselves a nice yellow dye. Really that simple. It will stain your clothing. I take just a few drops of that. Really not much. And I put that on the slide like so. Right. Next up, we're going to go into our moldy bread and try to find some fungal hyphae. All right. So we're just going in with our tweezers and pulling out the bits of fuzz that are sticking off the edge. Set that down on your slide, put your cover slip on, give it a little bit of a smash. All right. Then we're just gonna load up with our slide holder, our microscope, and we're good to go. We'll get some zygomycetes up close. Okay. This little microscope is pretty annoying to figure out how to use with your phone, but once you get it, it's not bad. All right. So pictured here, we're looking at zygomycete hyphae. Uh, it's easier to see with just your eye, but for taking pictures, all right. So they are seen acidic. I don't have septate hyphae. All right. So I'll just give you an idea of what this little scope is capable of. Not too bad. Okay, for my next trick, behold this package of wonton wrappers that got left in the fridge. This is a small package and it kind of got lost in there. But it looks beautiful now. All right, here we are zoomed in on the old wonton wrapper. And what we're seeing are these just nice fields of conidia, spores all over them. They look like little tree branches. Zoom in here. Oh, shaky image. that is just just lovely